It has to do with interpreting why the world is doing exactly what it's doing. Why there is no peace in the Middle East. There's a direct, deep, esoteric reason why there is turmoil in the Middle East. And it has to do with the fact that because the city of David is not there and that that is not the land promised to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, but literally when the Zionist movement picked up out of Central Europe and went backwards against the course of the light, they uh, set in motion events in the world that uh, have resulted in the conflagrations that are unfolding in reality right now. So there's, a, there's an interpretation for that. There's an interpretation for the reason uh, why the World Trade Center was uh, leveled. Why um, China and Russia have made an agreement to check American hegemony in the world. There's a meaning to all that. There's a meaning uh, for um, why China is right now making an agreement with certain uh, factions in Afghanistan um, also uh, in interest of checking American presence in Central Asia. There is a, a absolutely divine interpretation that goes with that. Why is the economy collapsing in Japan? Well, Japan, Japan's whole purpose in the historical scheme of things is to bring about a collapse of the entire Western economy. That is all written in the prophets. And so um, these are events that are getting ready to unfold in the world. And um, uh, so I guess, I guess we have um, um, some sort of sense of urgency and that we just want to make sure that those ideas are planted out everywhere.